Thank you, Mr. Speaker. It's always great to uh, follow the highly respected minority whip, um, and he is highly respected. I would say that there is a lot of pressing problems in this country. One I'll speak about today, and that's the high-level nuclear waste stored throughout this country. I would also say to my friend that uh, part of the jobs bill has been passed. We passed the free trade agreement. We passed the veterans benefit portion. We passed the 3 percent withholding. So there has been movement in a bipartisan manner on some provisions in the, in the bill. So now let me segue to I, an issue that I've come to the floor now six times as I go um, throughout the country and, and highlight where high-level nuclear waste is stored throughout this country. Um, today, we'll travel to the state of Massachusetts right on Cape Cod Bay, uh, where the Pilgrim Nuclear Power Plant sits. Again, it's uh, right on Cape Cod Bay. At Pilgrim, there are over 2,918 spent fuel assemblies on site. Yucca Mountain, which is the defined storage location by law in the 1982 Nuclear Waste Policy Act, uh, currently has no nuclear waste on site. I like to keep highlighting the real distinct differences based upon the years of talking about this issue and, and highlighting some of the arguments against Yucca, comparing it to where we have nuclear waste today. So let's again continue to look at, at the Pilgrim power plant, the waste is stored above ground in pools, very similar to Fukushima Daiichi in Japan. At Yucca, the waste will be stored 1,000 feet underground, above the ground in pools, 1,000 feet underground. I think Yucca is a better location. At Pilgrim, the waste is 20 feet from the water table, 20 feet. At Yucca, it would be 1,000 feet above the water table. I think that's a better, more safe and secure location. And you can see the Pilgrim plant is right on Cape Cod Bay, right next to the, to the water. Yucca Mountain is situated 100 miles from really the nearest body of water, which would be the Colorado River. Now, for those who've been following my time coming to the floor, this is my sixth time. So I started at Hanford, a DOE facility in Washington State, compared it to Yucca Mountain. I then went to uh, Zion. I got my friend from Chicago right here. Zion's right on Lake Michigan. Uh, it's a nuclear power plant uh, that has decommissioned plant waste still stored on site. But Wisconsin has two nuclear power plants right on Lake Michigan. Then I went to Savannah, Georgia to talk about the nuclear waste there. And of course, it's the Savannah River, so it's right next to the Savannah River. Then out to California to look at Santa Ofri, the uh, nuclear power plant that's right on the Pacific Ocean. Today, before today, then I went to Idaho and looked at the Idaho National Labs and the nuclear waste stored there. Today, we, we go to Massachusetts, the point being there's high-level nuclear waste stored all over this country. And a single repository at Yucca Mountain makes sense for all the right reasons. It's uh, over 100 miles from the largest city. It's in the desert. It would be underneath a mountain. There is no more safe, secure location. Why are we not moving forward? Because this administration uh, has decided not to spend the money needed to find to finish the final environmental study through the Nuclear Regulatory Commission. So where are our senators on this position? And I've been bringing this down to the floor through all these states. We need 60 votes in the Senate to secure America's nuclear waste. Right now, through the states, based upon the states we've identified, there's 20 yes. We've got about seven who are relatively new. We don't know their position. Of course, we have established uh, five that are no's. There are some in the New England states that I mentioned. Susan Collins voted for Yucca Mountain in 2002. Olympia Snow voted for it in 2002. Uh, Senator Kerry voted against it. Now, 
the, now Pilgrim is in the state of Massachusetts. Um, I, I guess Senator Kerry feels that Pilgrim is a more safe and secure location than, than Yucca Mountain, based upon his, his uh, statement. Scott Brown has no position yet. Uh, Senator Ayotte has no position. Senator Sheehan has no position. And uh, uh, of course, the independent from Vermont has voted no. And I yield back my time.